Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another daily vlog. It feels so weird. This is the fourth day in a row that I'm doing it now and actually the sixth day because if you count the weekend and the weekend venture, it's the sixth day in a row that I've made a video. So it feels kind of weird like recording your life every single day. Still getting used to the idea but like I said, it's something I want to do and get into. So got to learn to do it somehow, I guess. Um, just before we get into the video as well, I just want to thank you guys so much for all the support that you're showing on these videos so far. It's been amazing, even though it's only been four days. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate all the support and love and likes and comments and everything that you guys are giving me at the moment. So, thank you so much. So, later today, I am going with one of my classmates on an adventure to Yonkersuk. I don't really know where we're going yet over there. We don't really know much of the area, but we're just going to drive. She has a really cool old vintage Volkswagen Beetle. So we're gonna take a few pictures of that, get a few Instagrams, and a few cool cinematic sequences of that car, which is nice. So just quickly before I get started with the actual adventure, I wanted to speak about the idea of boredom. So since we're on holiday now, and all the students are on holiday as well, I've been seeing so many things of people saying that they're bored, they have nothing to do. Like, how are you bored? I feel like boredom is the biggest waste of time and procrastination that you can get in your life. I feel like you should be taking advantage of every single minute that you have in your day, especially at this age. Talking about people of my generation as well. I know most of you watching are between 18 and 24 years old, so it applies to everyone, I think. I think that you shouldn't be bored. I have, I literally have this book filled with ideas and stuff to do. I have a list of like three pages of stuff to do. So I think you should always try and keep yourself as busy as you can, always have something to do. Whether it's whatever you wanna do, just do what you love doing as long as you're doing something. Keep yourself busy, keep progressing your life and moving your life forward, making a positive impact on your life and the lives of others as well. So don't waste any time that you have do something and work hard at it so that you can make it into something that you earn money from one day and you'll just end up having a good life doing what you love. If you have no idea what you want to do with your life yet, then experiment and try and do new things, not drugs or alcohol. Try and do new activities, new fun things and see what you like, see what you're interested in and then go ahead and work hard and pursue that and make it something that you want to do for the rest of your life. But just do something so that you'll find out what you want to do and you can work on building on that. I feel like I'm getting cabin fever now. I've literally been in my room the whole day. I've got to get out, but it's getting super, super windy outside and I really hope that the wind dies down before I go on my mission because it's not going to be that great talking into this mic. I still need to get a fluffy thing for the mic so you don't hear the wind. That is one of the missions that I have to make. Maybe next week sometime I'll do that. I think I'm going to wear a hat otherwise my hair is going to get super messed up as always. So the hat is working for today. So windy outside. I'm gonna find it this way I'm never gonna break my never gonna break my bones And if you find it this way you're never gonna be I'm never gonna be Maybe if you reverse in here Okay, so we have come out into Yonkersuk now We found this really cool like pathway thing We parked the car now and it's super windy so hopefully you can hear me but it looks really cool with the car there with the lights on. We're just gonna take a few photos over here. Let's do this thing. I think I've got all that I need. Got everything on this location over here. Uh, still don't know where we're gonna go next. We're just gonna go somewhere. See you where we go. Great modeling then. <laughs> So you said the name of this car is Maurice. How did you get the name Maurice? Because I didn't even know that. Um, okay, well, Maurice, obviously when you look at the car, you'll understand why. Um, I don't think the door is probably oh. the <laughs> So Maurice, um, I drove like when I bought the car. Um, but the one guy, um, he didn't know it was a Beetle. It's called the Beetle. So he was just like, oh, Mortis. And I was like, uh, no, okay. it's a Beetle, but then... <laughs> And then I just thought of Maurice, so okay. yeah. 
And then so it's like, what's that? Yeah, that car. Yeah, I think of they. I think okay. of you thought it was like a. Because they sort of, sort of has like the same shape as yeah. well, so. Okay. <laughs> so that is how this car got the name Maurice. <laughs> Fun little bridge. Don't know where it goes. Um, you want to take some photos on this bridge though? Yeah. You can try right. that. Sorry, people. There's cars that want to come over the bridge now. This is like the least busy area in the whole of Stellenbosch. And then two cars decide to come over the bridge while we're taking photos. I've been seeing all, oh, I've been seeing your soul. Give me things that I wanted to know. Tell me things that you've done. I've been feeling old, I've been feeling cold Please let us in <laughs> Trying to see if we can go into a wine farm to check out the sunset How are you? We just want to um, have a drive and then just take a photo because he's a photographer. But I can't let you in it because it's private ground. I can lose my job with this camera. And... Oh well. That sucks. Okay, we tried. The guy's going to lose his job if he lets us in, so we don't <laughs> want that to happen. <laughs> so nice here. Yo. So we've just stopped off in the middle of some random wine farm. We have no idea where we are. We just drove into the wine farm, no one stopped us. So we found this really beautiful location with the mountains in the background. I'm um, just gonna get a few shots of the car with that view in the background. Sitting in the back seat of your mother's car There was forest on the way there You ain't all the way there Sent some complex signals to the others on the road I was sending all the mind beams Off to you. Yo, that was loud. Yeah, that's probably closed now, yeah? Yeah. Closed door properly. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't close the doors, <laughs> yeah. Earlier, I couldn't close this door to save my life. Like, it just didn't want to close. And I was like, Lynn, your car is broken. I can't do this. But, yeah, I got it right now. So now, mm. off to the next place. Don't know where that is, but once again, we're just going to go. That was nice. Yeah, it's such a beautiful place. Even with the horses and everything. Son. How are you? Fine, thank you. Um, I'm just gonna turn around, so we're just gonna have a drive and then come back. Turn so, around. yeah. No problem. Thank you. Set done. <laughs> so windy outside. Quick update on the video. We are just stopping off. We're back in Stellenbosch. We're gonna go have some coffee in the town and get warm again because it's freezing cold and it's super windy outside and it's cold and yeah. Thanks so much for. So I'll let you know when we do something yeah. again. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for being a model and thanks for letting me use your car for photos and stuff. Okay. Just get over here, nice little car. And on that note, I'm going to end today. Uh, I hope that I got enough visuals for this episode. I feel like it was very difficult to capture the cinematography or the video part of the video. Well, that's kind of what a whole video is, the point of the video is. Um, I hope I got enough video cinematic sequence footage and storyline behind it. Because it was difficult to take photos and videos at the same time. But anyway, that has passed. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Just a quick reminder. 
If you didn't see yesterday, I released a presets pack that I made yesterday. Um, it has nine of my own presets, and if you use the coupon code WEEK1 when purchasing it, it's on my website. I'll leave the link in the description as well, then you will get 25% off. So definitely go check it out if you're interested in that and anything to do with editing or photography or that kind of thing, or Instagram or just, yeah, photos in general. Go check it out, let me know what you think, tag me in your pictures that you use the presets with, and I'll feature the best ones. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching today. If you did like this video, please leave a like. If you're new around here, hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Okay, bye. Okay, I'm gonna go away. Walk away slowly. I feel like those horses don't want me to come touch them while they're eating. They're just like, nope, leave me alone. <laughs> Get away from me. <laughs> I was going so slowly. <laughs> I was being so careful. I don't know, I was being careful of the other one facing the other way. I'm just gonna quick update. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. I can't even. Quick update on the video. We are just stopping off. We, we, uh, what am I saying? <laughs> Quick up. <laughs> oh, I can't do this. <laughs> Quick up there.